Hi, I'm John Twist of University Motors. Today I want to talk about brake rotors. We had an interesting one today. We're doing an MGA. Here's this MGA here. In relatively uh, uh, primered condition, actually it's brush painted. But we're doing all the suspension and all the brakes to make it fully functional. And Forrest was removing the brake rotor, which we we're gonna change anyway and he was wrapping it with the hammer and it broke apart. But look what we found. This is, fre this is a fresh break here, you can see that. But look at the rust all the way around. So this thing had already been broken here. That's why we're doing a complete brake job and just changing everything. Not changing the drums. Drums are hardly ever bad, but here's the here's the brake rotor and again the other part of it and you can see here that this is all a fresh brake but you get to right here and that that old brake has been there well last time the car was driven was 30 years ago. So that begs the question how often do brake rotors go bad? I have several examples here. This came off Jim Osthoff's MGB race car. This is an MGB. I want you to see the, the cracks here, the radial cracks, caused by overheating. This wouldn't happen in, nor in a normal street car. This is strictly race car stuff. You can see how thick the rotor is. It's nice and thick, but it's, uh, it's got these heat cracks, which begged uh, that it should be removed. This is dated from 02. Jim, uh, Jim won in his race car. He, uh, he, he got first place in the vintage MG group. Uh, fastest MGB out there one year. The, uh, the, the late Eric Jones from Riverside Motors. Everybody remembers Eric as a smiling guy, but those who knew him best knew that he didn't always smile. He could have quite a temper. And he found lots of humor. This one from an MG midget. This is what Eric wrote. The driver swore she'd never heard any grinding noise from the brakes. He, he knew that I had this uh, display of used and broken parts. This isn't the one that comes off of here. This is another one. So this is, these are off midgets. So this has happened at least twice as long as I've been in the trade. So just a cautionary. The front brakes are almost always okay. But don't disregard the rotors. Rotors are so cheap. And remember they fit the disc brakes to the twin cams and deluxes, the MGA 1600s, all the MGBs, and the midgets from, oh help me out, about 1964 onwards. So anyway, brake rotors. Don't ignore them when you're doing a brake job. Okay? Hey, um, oh, our summer party, August 17th, which begs the question, which year? This is 2013. Today is the 12th of July. Independence Day has already gone by. Corvallis, Washington is at the end of next week. I'll be out there. Um, anyway, come to our summer party. Go on our website, look, look at our sign-up sheet, and sign up for our summer party. It's going to be a fun time, August 17th. Until then, safety fast.